Well, the first time I was on KBOO was 1972. I'd been doing radio on my college radio station. I, I really wanted to be a DJ. L.A. had these really cool underground FM rock stations in the late 1960s where DJs, it was called Freeform Rock. They had the freedom to play their own music, and it wasn't just rock. It was jazz, and you know, you, you could go from Charles Lloyd to Joan Baez to Albert King to the Beatles. And, you know, it was inspiring to me as a young man. So I came up here to visit in 1972, and I, I walked in the door at KBU. The program director there was Bill Reinhardt, and I told him I'd been doing radio at my college radio station. Bill threw me on the air engineering an avant-garde electronic music show, which I knew nothing about. It was on a reel-to-reel, and I realized partway through the show that I that the show was on a 12-inch reel, but I would had it spooled onto a 7-inch reel, and so the tape was just coming off onto the ground, and I had to make a decision whether to stop the show or just let it keep going. <laughs> and so the tape just wound up all over the floor because I didn't want to stop the show in the middle of the show. <laughs> 